Rob, there are 101 county coroners in the state of Illinois and one medical examiner here in Cook County. Earlier today, all of them got on a conference call to talk about their concerns handling bodies that may have been exposed to COVID-19. And so after that phone call, the Cook County medical examiner talked with the I team. A caseload search, it could be hundreds of cases, thousands of cases. We need to be prepared for it. Here at the Cook County Morgue, this trailer is a sign that the number of coronavirus deaths is likely to get far worse. It is a refrigerated unit with a large sheet of plywood to block the view when bodies are moved. These trailers were needed in the 1995 heat wave when nearly 740 died during a blistering five day stretch. Here this afternoon, yellow tape, not marking a crime scene, just displaying the word caution. And that is an important word these days. These cases are going into the refrigerator trailer and we're doing the external exam and the swabs in the trailer. In most cases, she tells the I-team COVID-19 can be confirmed safely through a lab test and external exam, not subjecting doctors and technicians to possible aerosol contamination during a more dangerous internal exam. What is the worst case scenario in this? Um, the worst case scenario would be you know, a lot more deaths than an office can handle. Uh, but, you know, we need to be prepared for any eventuality. Uh, we're looking at, you know, more storage space, for example, it's not just our refrigerator trailers. Away from your campus or on your in your parking lot? Uh, we're looking at spaces away from our campus. Her training, expertise and business is something many people find difficult to discuss. Her outlook and final words are inspiring. We're the last physicians who see these patients, so they need to be treated with dignity. Today, she had to invoke that philosophy two more times. That's the number of deaths announced today, additionally in Cook County from COVID-19, a 69-year-old man in Oak Lawn and a 62-year-old man in Chicago. Reporting live, Chuck Gowdy, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.